she's crying so hard. We are we are freaking homeowners right now. <laughs> Last night sleeping in the RV. <laughs> Our cat's looking. At Our cat, I feel like she knows something's happening. Wait. Eyes are huge. She right knows now. something's <laughs> happening. That's the clothes I'm gonna wear tomorrow. It's your last night sleeping in the RV, kitten. <laughs> Luke was up at 3 a.m., right? Mm -hmm. Was it because you were excited? No. <laughs> excited and nervous? Yeah. Well, we'll go that. <laughs> we're making our commute to work from here for the last time. I mean, we'll be coming back to move stuff, obviously, so it's not like we're leaving, leaving. But the next time we come back, we'll be kitty napping our kitten, and she'll be moving for the for the last time. Well, she'll be moving for realsies, and we wish we had some PTO to be able to use to take off this whole day. But we're gonna go to work for a couple hours, we're gonna get in at 7:30 and leave at around 10:30, 10 10:45, 10 because we already had a trip planned to go visit family and. Memorial Day week time, so that's using up like all of our PTO. <laughs> so we didn't have any for now, but luckily we have a flexible job that will let us do this. So we have to go to work and try to focus <laughs> on work for a couple hours, and then we get to go to our closing. Then we get the keys. Yay! Then we're coming back. We're leaving work now. <laughs> we're heading to our closing. <laughs> Luke's looking fly. Are you ready? We're here. We're here like 15 minutes early just sitting in the parking lot. <laughs> no. We own a home now. We'll have to show you our closing gifts and stuff that we got from our real estate agent, but um, the guy here at the title agency, the closing thing, he was like really helpful. He explained like every single document and he even showed us like how exactly we could pay off our mortgage early in 15 years or seven years. So now we are, we are freaking homeowners right now. <laughs> <laughs> now all the work begins. Now all the work begins, but it's our house now. Oh my goodness. It's so crazy when we signed the contract on March 31st. So right before April Fool's Day, on, on April 1st we were doing all this paperwork and stuff because we'd signed our contract. That's when it really started rolling. And then May 17th was our day and we made it. We made it! <laughs> Now we're starving, we need to go get some lunch, but now we just want to go to our house! Yeah. You did it! We did it! Alright, we're starving, so we're gonna grab some Palace Pizza in Lakeland. They have gluten-free option. Oh, they're not open. Okay, they're not open. Guess we're going somewhere else. We ate at Harry's. We tried to go to Palace and it was closed. And it was really good seafood. It's our celebratory dinner, lunch. And now we're heading to our house. We gotta go tell our kitten the good news. She's gonna be so excited. She has no idea what's coming for her. She's about to have a wild ride. This house is a wreck.
she's taking her final poo poo in there. <laughs> now I'm gonna take you into the bedroom and load up our, oh, we've got toiletries and bedding. Last thing we need to pack is this one. You ready to go to your new home? She just went potty, so she should be fine. <laughs> go on in. It's time. I promise you're going to like go. it when you get to the other side. You're going to be so excited. <laughs> All right. So that's everything from here. That we can pack today anyway. Yeah. Our car is maxed. It's packed. We will show you when we get in there. Yeah. But we're going to our new home now. Yeah. Yay. <laughs> it's so packed in here. My cat is freaking out. She has no idea. And I don't know. I feel like I just keep coming on filming. Oh no, I'm going to get copyright. But it's just so freaking exciting. We never thought this day would come. Here it is. She's crying so hard. I feel like she knows something. Yeah. What's wrong, baby? Yeah. Why are you crying? Yeah. You scared? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> we never hear her cry like Though. You will. You're gonna have so much room for activity. Oh my gosh. Here we go. <laughs> She's our music, so now we can listen to her as music instead of a copyright music. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> I think she's claustrophobic. We just pulled into our house. <laughs> We're here. We're going to let you out now. There she goes. She's out. We let her out. <gasps> She's already figured out she can go from my ledges. She's like, put me back in there, take me back home. This is your home now. It's still your same dad. Check out the house. I told you, still blend in with the floor. You scared? Luke's bringing in the cold stuff, and then we're gonna do a house tour, but, oh my gosh, he's bringing it into our freezer and our full-size fridge. It's my house. <laughs> we locked our kitten in that room. You'll see it on our house tour, what it is. Oh, yay. Full size fridge. Three times the size of our. And that's probably a small fridge to a lot of people, but that's a huge fridge to us. A full size freezer. Yes! A full size kitchen. Yes! Now she's in here, all used to this room, cowering away. 
whenever we come over. Hello? Where are you? Come here, baby. She found somewhere to hide, of course. Come on. Hi. <laughs> she was gonna hide from you, and then she realized it was you. She's like, oh, thank goodness, I was so scared. Wow, these are her first purrs. <laughs> oh my gosh. She's like, I'm so scared and then you're there and I'm not scared anymore. You like your new hangouts? Well, she's already broken in that. Going on top of the fridge. Guess we gotta leave that place empty for her. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> we're moving stuff in just like we're on vacation or on a trip. Putting stuff on our covered porch because although it's sunny, it's about to rain out there. Bringing stuff in. All right, so I wanted to show off our closing gifts that we got from our real estate agent. So we worked with a group called Meg Homes and we will link more information about that, but it says find your perfect home from Meg Homes. There's no information like online or anything about our specific house. So I think it's safe to say we shopped with Meg Homes and they were very good. Um, Angie Reynolds was our real estate agent. In case you're looking for Central Florida real estate, we highly recommend Meg Homes. She gave us a Lowe's gift card that we're gonna use. She said we should use it on a mailbox, which that's actually a really good idea. I need to show the mailbox how bad it is right now. It says go Gators, so bad. But she gave us a cute note and this was one part of our gift. A really cute, like, you know, I think it's from Lowe's, but cute plant that our kitten's already starting to eat. And she gave it to, to us at closing, but I didn't, I wasn't able to have our camera at closing. So, but she also got us this really nice terrarium. And oh my gosh, it's so cute. I already know where I want to put it. So it's adorable. There's a dragonfly, dragonfly wing stuck in it. Isn't that weird? <laughs> Can you see that? But yeah, a gorgeous, I think this is also from Lowe's, Ellen and Roth, but totally could hang it somewhere. And I actually think I want to put it by the fireplace, but she's like, it would be protected from your cat. <laughs> like that's a great idea. So definitely gonna test out a terrarium. I haven't owned one before, so that'll be fun. So thank you to Meg Holmes and to Angie for your awesome clothing gifts. This looks cute in our kitchen already. I want to add some color in here and I'll show you some things I've already done around the house. So we just came in from outside. We just did our pictures and videos to be able to announce our new house. I've already put down our new rug that we bought off the marketplace. Our kitten is literally everywhere. We brought in all of our stuff and we, Luke is already trying to figure out a plan for painting in here. We forgot a drop cloth, so He's gonna have to figure out, and he doesn't have a stool, but I guess he's gonna stand in his toolbox. Cause we need to paint up there so we can hang the curtains and you can see our neighbor's house is right there. So we definitely want some curtains. <laughs> he's gonna use our top sheet that we brought to sleep with as a drop cloth cause we forgot and it's better than having our brand new carpet ruined. So <laughs> I'd rather have a cheap top sheet ruined. Just have to paint this section and get the curtains up. Starting the painting. He says it's not going well. Why? He's doing the cut in method where you don't have to tape. You need to be up higher.
I'm gonna create some microwave gluten-free hot pocket and I'm christening our stove using it for the first time making some healthy nutritious mac and cheese we have like cooking utensils but we forgot eating utensils so I guess we're just gonna eat with these we'll be fine it's normal moving stuff and I've already got kitten footprints all over this She's gonna learn quick that you cannot walk all over my counters everywhere. She walks right there. She's gonna have burned beans. She hasn't gone to the bathroom yet, which is concerning us. I moved the plant in here so she'd stop eating it on my kitchen counter. And now she finally ventures out of the kitchen counters into here and she's like, ooh. The lighting in here though. So right. The water pressure in here though. So good. It's not coming out of the hose. Really? Oh, that's, that's the yeah. The water pressure is so intense. I grabbed this shower curtain for our master shower and I love it. Love it so much. My kitten's in there being snoopy. She's on, found another cat. There's a cat across the street. There's our neighbor cat. I think they did already look each other in the eyes through the window, so they've been acquainted. And then it's just reminding me how much we cannot let her get out. <laughs> she's finally ready to settle down and she was falling asleep over there and then she's like oh Luke's lap I need to come lay on that like I'm fine as long as Luke comes with me anywhere I go. <laughs> Such a cutie. Well the first anchor literally exploded when he was putting it in and now there's a big hole <laughs> so he's trying again. We just took a quick trip to Publix, literally two minutes down the road. Would have been so helpful when we were in our RV <laughs> to have a Publix so close. And we got some litter for this little girl and she went potty right away. So she didn't like the litter that we have for her. And then, yeah, Luke got some booch. And now we have to do this and it's nine o'clock at night and we're getting pretty tired. I'm gonna blow up the air mattress while he's working on this. Actually, I should probably clip the... Here's our lovely air mattress for the night. It's actually a really big air mattress. It's really nice. This almost seems like a legit bed and now it is a queen, I'm pretty sure. Maybe it's a double. Kind of nice seeing like what the bed will actually look like in here. Like I thought a bed would take up more space than that and it's not that bad actually. Still good walking space. So finally time to settle down for the night. Look at his booch. And we hung up this curtain by the way. And it's looking pretty good. We hung up this curtain too.